Hello guys, we are back with our next tutorial. In this tutorial, let's see all about AVL tree. Basically, A stands for Adelson, V stands for Peleski, and L stands for Lendis. So now, I hope everyone got a small idea on those three scientist names because that's one of the most important thing you need to remember, guys. I'm saying you clearly, you need to remember their names. So, it is nothing but it is a binary search tree and and it also follows the balance factor so now you'll be asking what is balance factor so balance factor is nothing but at each and every node height of the left subtree minus height of the right subtree should be minus 1 0 or 1 okay so hl is nothing but height of left and hr is nothing but height of right so now i hope everyone got a small idea on avl tree so we'll be seeing an example so here there is only the root with no children so 0 minus 0 is 0 hence this follows the avl tree similarly a root with exactly one children on the right and one children on the left it follows binary tree as 0 0 0 it's a perfectly balanced binary tree sorry it's perfectly balanced avl tree guys i messed up with this names fine okay so here we are having one on the left one for that right one here we are having on the left side only we are having 2 minus 0 that is equals to 2 this is not going to be a binary tree so basically while you are solving come from down here 0 minus 0 0 0 minus 1 minus 1 this is this is fine so 2 minus 0 is minus plus 2 so this is completely not a avl tree so now i hope everyone got a small idea on this so there are four problems guys which we face while constructing an AVL tree. Basically the first one will be left to left rotation problem guys. So we will be changing this ninth position to right. We will be rotating it a bit on the right side. So that it becomes a V with 3, 4, 9 which follows the perfect balance that is 0, 0, 0. Here also 0. Fine. So now I hope everyone is now clear with our, our rotation guys will be going through a problem don't worry just observe it carefully in the problem I'll be saying you the rotation name you need to do it okay so further moving on right right rotation problem here we got an element to right to right so here we are having minus 2 so by just rotating it bending it like this we're gonna get like V again so this is perfectly balanced fine so there is one more more two types guys that is left right rotation problem so this is left right rotation problem nine nines left six six right seven so initially we'll be changing these two positions guys so once we change it we're gonna push it like this so that it it forms a l l rotation problem so we'll be just rotating it back so we're gonna get the perfectly balanced avl tree further moving on r l rotation problem so here we're gonna get right left so now we'll be exchanging them we'll be making it rr so we'll be pushing it like this so we're gonna get a balanced thing so now i hope everyone got a small a bit or a pinch of idea on avl so now let us go through the problem on it 21 12 16 14 8 4 3 right so now so now it's time to construct an avl tree guys what are you waiting for come on let's do it so basically i21 i'll be using i for insertion guys that's the main symbol that i use mostly that is i means insertion insert 21 that is nothing but 21 directly insert 12 that is nothing but 21 sorry 21 12 will be on the left side according to the binary tree binary search tree property insert 16 21 12 where will be 16 going for this right so if you observe cleanly this is the shape of that that is nothing but left right rotation problem so we'll be exchanging them so that it forms r sorry l l rotation problem now right so now we'll be shuffling it like this 16 12 21 so this will be a avl tree balanced so I have just forgot about that guys 0 0 1 here it is minus 2 that's the reason why we have done it so here it is minus 1 here it is 0 here it is minus 2 again 
we have just done this so here it is 1 here it is 0 so here is 0 0 0 so now from now I'll be doing it guys I have just forgot about that to calculate it so insert 14 14 where will it go 16 12 21 14 is greater than 12 right so now it's like this so but if you try 0 minus 1 0 2 minus 1 it is nothing but 1 so it's satisfying so further moving on we got 8 okay let us insert 8 now 8 that is nothing but 16 12 21 so it is less than 12 8 14 so 0 0 0 this is nothing but 2 this is equals to 1 so this is 0 so it is also satisfying luckily so now the last insertion is nothing but 4 insert 4 guys observe this carefully so the highest one is 16 the next one is 12 the next one is 8 and less than 8 we got 4 right so for sorry for 12 we got 14 and for 16 we got 21 so always remember that we'll be taking the longest chain so here we got three terms so let us come from down only 0 0 0 1 1 minus how much 1 2 3 2 1 sorry 1 2 3 minus 1 it is equals to 2 so this is going to fail so the latest element is this so touch that somehow so this is our problem this is nothing but ll problem so i'll be making 8 as our root node now so 8 on one side we're gonna get 4 and on the other side we're gonna get 16 so now substitute all the rest three values in this okay basically we will be substituting what shall we substitute first okay just give me a second guys i think i just did a small mistake okay we should not include this four sorry why do i do this mistake again and again okay we'll be taking these guys sorry for that so our root node will be 12 and this will be 16 and this will be 8 okay guys so now we'll be substituting all the rest out values so here we'll be getting 4 and here we'll be getting 21 and here we'll be getting 14 so 0 0 0 here we're gonna get what will be get guys here we're gonna get 0 here we got get 1 2 2 0 so now I hope everyone is clear with it so let us assume if there is one more element okay there is one more element guys I didn't see it there is 3 also so now for this we need to insert 3 okay so now let us see this 8 I'll be not drawing circles guys because those circles are confusing me okay 14 21 okay guys got it okay so if you observe this cleanly here we got 1 2 3 sorry 0 0 0 you want like that guys right 1 here only we got 2 this is going to be a problem so we need to increase the pro include the problemed element so we'll be just shuffling this so that everything will be trying to set 3 minus 2 is 1 so here it is set so this is the main problem piece so 4 will be the root 3 will be here 8 will be there so now I hope everyone got a small idea that why did I do like that so this I'll be substituting directly there so I'm going to get 12 4 3 8 16 14 21 so 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 a complete tree with complete zeros and we followed all the rules of AVL tree which follows all the rules of AVL tree so this is going to be our complete AVL tree guys this is not a normal AVL tree it's going to be a complete AVL tree thank you Thanks for watching. In the next tutorial, we'll be going through binary tree. Thank you guys. Thanks for watching.